Hello, it is Dr. Bong, Happy Instrument. Pressure is divided into the type that can measure vacuum pressure and the type that can measure positive pressure. Prepared to help you understand vacuum and positive pressure. I will explain by looking at the picture. We live on Earth. 1 atm, 760 mmHg, 1013 hectopascal, 1. 033 kg per square centimeter. 1.013 bar is the state of pressing. The state of being pressed at a pressure of about 1 bar is referred to as atmospheric pressure. A good example of the atmospheric pressure is as follows. If you go to a high mountain, the atmospheric pressure drops. So you need to put a heavy stone on the rice cooker to eat delicious rice to increase the pressure by the weight of the stone. If you have an experiment, you must be careful to watch out for fire. The state of which the pressure of atmospheric pressure 1 bar has completely disappeared is called vacuum. The vacuum is minus 1 bar, 0 bar ABS. 0 tor minus 760 mmHg. ABS stands for absolute pressure and is a unit for expressing absolute pressure. Vacuum is not Earth on which gravity works because it's a space. If there's a vacuum hole right next to us, all is sucked up there. Positive pressure is higher than atmospheric pressure. A barometric pressure plus 1 bar is expressed by 1 bar g. 14.5 psi g, 100 kilopascal g. g is an abbreviation for gauge and is a unit for expressing the pressure visible through the instrument. In terms of a person's position, it is like diving in water below 10 meters. The earth we live in cannot fall below minus 1 bar. The reason for uploading this video is that you want to buy a pressure indicator from minus 2 bar to plus 2 bar or minus 3 bar to plus 3 bar. You ask for a generous range of preparedness, but it's a pressure range that we cannot create on our planet. Perhaps this is a misunderstanding because the differential pressure transmitter can be expressed below minus 1 bar. Please keep in mind that you cannot make a pressure indicator like minus 2 to plus 2 bar or minus 3 to plus 3 bar. Thank you. Dr. Bong, Happy Instruments. If you find this helpful, please subscribe.